Hello everyone, this is Nicholas with Owl Homes of Fredonia. And today we are checking out this beautiful Cape Cod modular home that we are just finishing up on this very nice piece of property in Gowanda, New York. You can hear all the animals today making noises and uh, it is very nice out here. This is a 1600 square foot on the main floor Cape Cod home, which gives it a additionally 1600 square foot full basement underneath it, as well as 1100 unfinished square feet upstairs. So this is an over 4,000 square foot structure, around 4,300 square feet total. So it's a little bit muddy around this site. So I'm gonna get you straight into the home and I'll be able to kind of hang out the doorways in the back and show you the backyard. And here we are. I'm just gonna take my shoes off and we will check this all out. Very large main living area here. You have the stairs going to the upstairs and behind it down to the basement. Tons of storage in here and just an amazing pantry. Check out this pantry. Absolutely beautiful and you can close it right off. And it's got a window in it. So it has a very nice pantry and kitchen setup. Huge island in here. Everything is soft clothes in the whole house. Just wait until you see this master suite in this house. It is absolutely beautiful. And the size of this sink, I believe this is called the galley sink and the chef spring faucet. So that is a really nice upgrade. And there's the entrance to the basement. Nice tall ceilings, tons of lighting in here. And love the way they did this back setup. I'm gonna try to adjust the brightness here so you can see it. And there is that. Absolutely beautiful. And I wanna show you how the uh, air conditioner gets installed here. So we got it up off the ground back here and it's kind of hanging right off of the house. Makes it a lot easier to landscape around that. It just looks a lot nicer. So beautiful piece of property here. Could stand outside and listen to the critters all day. So beautiful setup back here. Love how they put the two windows next to the door. Nice big windows. So I am gonna take you into the secondary bedrooms first. I'm gonna make you wait for the master, which is over there last, because that is an absolutely beautiful master setup, beautiful master bathroom. But over here, and not to mention, this is a huge nook area. This is probably easily 12 to 15 feet wide, this space. So it can definitely fit a very large table here and get the whole family all together which is I'm sure what they're looking to do. So here we have, we'll call bedroom number two. And the bedrooms in this home are pretty good size. And you can look at the sizes of all the rooms on the floor plan in the beginning of the, the video. Good size closets for these secondary bedrooms. Here is bathroom number two. Nice light above the vanity here. Really nice colors. Next we have the utility room over here is awesome. But next we have bedroom number three. So this is gonna be 
pretty much the same thing as bedroom number two. I think bedroom number two might be a little bit larger. You can fact check me on the beginning of the video there where the floor plan is. And here we are in this utility room. So there's the side door. And this utility room has got everything you need in it. Full washer dryer set up right here. Some storage with a sink, absolutely great to have here. And hot water tank is contained here. And I would assume the furnace is contained here, yep. So all tucked away back here at the end of the home in the utility room so that you don't have to hear it and uh, saves a ton of money. We call that an in-home package and it's a really good option. Comes right from the factory set up like that, all installed already so that you don't have to have it installed in the basement on site. It is of course all preference, but that can be a massive money saver right there. So before we go downstairs or upstairs, we're gonna go into the master bedroom and suite. Give you one more look at this from this side. It is just beautiful in here. And I always say in every video, the videos are great, but they do not do size justice. This is very large in here. All right, I'm going to the master suite now. Same thing with this master bedroom. This is a, this is a huge bedroom. Um, you can check the dimensions once again in the beginning of the video, but this is definitely a really large room and the closet does not protrude out into it. It is a whole walk-in closet right there in front of me. So huge walk-in closet in here. This is awesome. They chose some really nice carpets for the bedrooms too. And last but not least for the main floor here, check out this master suite. Unbelievable bathroom, four by six, rainfall shower head, tile shower with handheld shower head and normal shower head. So <clears throat> we've got the double vanity, double lab sinks here. Nice uh, curvature and uh, design here in the drywall, uh, lighting mounted on the bottom of that. Trim section there, storage, tons of cabinetry. Um, I like this, this is a huge middle section here in between the two sinks. It's like you're five feet away from each other and you've got all the storage in between you. So this is really cool. And once again, three shower heads in this shower here. So I haven't even taken the plastic off of the handheld one yet, but this is just absolutely beautiful. and even more storage over here. So we've of course got the uh, toilet area over here, which is kind of sectioned off, which is really nice. And then a ton more storage here. Just an absolutely awesome master setup with a little bit of natural light over there with the window as well. Take a look at it from this way. Really cool. Really nice. So now next we are going to toss our shoes back on and head up to the storage area in the upstairs. So here we are at the bottom of the steps and we'll work our way up here. Okay, so this is awesome to see. You can really see the construction of these homes and how they are built with the upstairs of the Cape Cods. And it is just huge up here. So once again, an additional 1,100 square feet up here. So this is a true test in all these videos when I say the videos just don't do size justice. You know, you tell me if this looks like 1,100 square feet in the video right now. 
because to me in the videos it looks like about half of that so it looks around twice as big in person up here so once again this is over 4,000 square feet this total structure with the basement and this upstairs and this is all ready to go it's insulated it's um, got hot and cold water stubbed up here electric line stubbed up here so it is ready to finish it can be finished at any time and it's just a beautiful extra space to have so next and last but not least we're going to go down into the basement so i can show you the big open basement as well which is even larger than this upstairs area That's that. Just can't get over how big this island is in this kitchen. And all the storage. But here we are going down into the basement. And this is all built on site. So everything you see here, the home itself, when you order it from the factory, it comes with just a, a well here. It's just an open, it is just an open cavity. We have to build this entire drywall structure the whole way down, build the steps the whole way down, the, the stairwell um, lighting and all that. And then, so that's included in our basement packages. And then everything else you see down here is also of course, included in our turnkey basement packages that we offer with every every home. So here you have a 1,600 square foot basement, and I am just going to walk around the whole thing. Here is the egress window, so this is like an emergency escape. And I'll adjust the brightness here so you can see kind of the ladder there. So there's that. So that's required by code now. If you don't have a set of Bilco doors or something, you'll at least need the egress window. So huge down here, there's about 58 feet between me and that other wall. Everything's insulated. Our basement packages come with a sump crock with a sump pump installed in it on its own separate circuit. Modular homes come with 200 amp electrical panels. We provide a dehumidifier with every basement package to make sure it is uh, in good condition down here and everything looks pristine to me down here right now some pump set up out to the drainage outside and so this is our basement packages and even a home this big you'd be surprised what you can do something like this for um, we always encourage everybody to reach out to our office or come on down. Um, you may not know Owl Homes of Fredonia is the largest modular and manufactured home campus in the Western New York area and beyond. Um, we're not familiar with anybody who has more homes to view on their property within a couple hundred miles at least. So come on, check us out. And, you know, the worst thing that you can do if you are interested at all in building a new home is not ask about pricing and not look into it uh, because you may be very surprised once again what you can get into something like this or the ton of other options that we have for. So come on down, check it out. We are super friendly, easy to work with. We make it a fun time when you come down to our, our office and walk through the homes. We have at least 15 homes on display, around $2 million in manufactured and modular homes on display. Um, and our staff, our consultants, our reps are more than happy to walk you around and talk to you about it. 
and just give you information. You know, what what does the total dollar amount mean? What does that mean your down payment would be? What does that mean your monthly payment would be? Um, those are the kind of things that it shouldn't be so hard to figure out. So we have made that extremely easy for you. Come on down. Let's use an example. Let's give you some pricing on what exactly it could cost you. Get one last view of this main floor and that is going to be all. I thank you so much for watching this video and if you've checked out our other videos, thank you so much for that as well. We really appreciate the support. We really appreciate um, Google reviews. If you've watched our videos and you like our videos or you've come into our office and had a good experience, we'd love to hear about it. Our team greatly appreciates it. So thank you so much again for watching the video and like and subscribe and we've got a lot more coming. Once again, I'm Nicholas with Owl Homes of Fredonia and have a great day.